when we started making Dead Space Extraction, we knew that we had to deliver on horror, action, and a cinematic experience. And the reason we needed to do that was because we're following up Dead Space, which was a game where a lot of people found it to be really scary, really liked the graphics, and of course the audio was amazing. So on Extraction, it was a goal from the very get-go to make sure that we lived up to that same experience that the original Dead Space had. <laughs> Extraction, for the most part, there's no time. There's more action and more stuff going on, and we did the visuals to pop and be readable. So you see um, bolder silhouettes and some brighter colors and some stronger, more graphic stuff. I think one of the greatest things about this game is that it really feels like you're playing a character in a horror movie. The camera, the way that we frame all the action, and the sort of cinematic feel you get from a author camera really, really immerses you like no game that I've ever seen before. At certain points in the game, your main player or the people around you are going to start to experience dementia. It's caused by the marker being extracted but it affects different people in different ways. Some people can work through it, but some people actually end up going crazy. They kill themselves, they kill their loved ones. It's all part of how the necromorph mythology works. Dementia? Interesting. Why? We've all seen what she was talking about. Indeed. So why aren't we going crazy too? He's right. None of us have been affected. You never know if what you're seeing is real. There'll be points in the game where you're walking down a hallway and you think you see an enemy, you'll shoot and all of a sudden he'll vanish. You'll turn around and where there was once a door, there's now a tunnel. You'll look around and you'll see that all of a sudden you're in neck deep water, whereas before you thought you were standing in just a shallow puddle. These kind of experiences really kind of catch you off guard and it really makes you question what's real and what's not. One other part of the game where we put a lot of effort into making it tie back into the original Dead Space, but also add an objective that was kind of terrifying was when you were building the barricade in the medical deck. And the idea was the team in Extraction actually had to rivet all those pieces into place while trying to fend off necromorphs. And if you didn't do that fast enough, a drag tentacle bursts through and grabs you. If there was one thing that I could tell the fans of Dead Space about Dead Space Extraction is that it's for real. It's got all the action, maybe even more of the fear. It's even more involving, and uh, I think fans are really going to dig it.